What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable EAFC24 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com and make a purchase. Next time you guys also want to make a purchase, use the code DAN to get 6% off on making that team better. Also on the same website, if you ever want to sell your coins, you click on the help center and click on the selling section. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel now boys and today I'm going to go ahead and review a special icon. It's going to be 93 rated Thunderstruck Icon Puskas. We're looking at the cards. 5-8 high medium work rates, 4 star skill moves, 3 star weak foot with the left foot. Acceleration type is mostly explosive, 91 pace, 95 shooting, 91 passing, 92 dribbling, 76 physicality, power shot, he has rapid, flair, First touch on plus, Travella, and quick step as well. I do like that this card has both rapid and quick step. That is absolutely clutch. Now, I'm going to go ahead and give this card the engine chemistry style because on footpin, it was the most common chem style. So, it kind of makes sense. Acceleration 96, sprint speed 94. Shooting is already top tier. So, I feel like you don't need to max it out. 96 finishing, 95 shot power is already really, really high. With the engine chemistry style, you basically maxed out the balance, maxed out the dribbling, and the agility goes up to 95, which is absolutely amazing. You also max out, if not boost up a lot of the passing stats, so that's absolutely amazing as well. He has 90 stamina, so it means he's gonna last you the whole game. Puskas is gonna be playing with this team right here. In a 4-3-2-1 as a solo striker, right in front of that Killing Mbappe player of the month. Now, I'm gonna be completely honest, I was not... Looking forward to reviewing Puskas because he's 4-3. I know I'm going to be hated from a lot of people, but I do not rate Puskas any single FIFA year. Until he gets like a special card where he has like 5-star skill moves or 5-star weak foot. But to be fair, he has the two most overpowered traits for an attacker in the video game. He has rapid and quick step. Even if they are on basic, I'm going to keep an open mind. Give this card a fair shot. And you guys let me know in the comment section down below for those of you guys that tried Puskas this year. If you guys rate him, we're going to play some foot champs and hopefully this card's pretty good because he's currently going around 2 million coins. Game number one versus Jager Munich. All right, let's see what type of team he has at the moment. So the back line's good. Midfield's okay. And the attack is all right. It's nothing crazy. So it should be a good test for the card. Oof, unlucky on that miss Puskas. Oh my goodness, that was a good try. I thought I was going to go in. Good physicality to keep onto the ball. I like how he feels on the ball. I'm not going to lie. Puskas feels absolutely amazing on the ball so far. Nah, that left stick dribbling is amazing. I don't know how he missed that, but This guy just got cooked. Holy shit, just got cooked with the R1 dribbling and a good finish finally from the car. That was nice. R1 dribbling is very overpowered from Puskas. Oh my goodness, that R1 dribbling is insanely broken with the card and another good finish. That was nice. Blanc had no chance in catching up. Good try. Oh, he's through. Puskas. Far post. Beautiful finish to make it 3-2 to two in the 80 and men and ice in the veins from the card. Good stuff. Oof, Puskas missed with the weak foot, unfortunately. Nice. Left stick dribbling is amazing. Wow, that's just absolutely fire. Weak foot? Good finish with the weak foot. Like I said, man, three-star weak foot is sometimes a little sus, but he was able to put it in the back of the net there. Damn, I tried to shoot that with the Travella. I don't know why the game didn't register that. Nice, great finish inside the box. Beautiful stuff. Ooh, let's go. We cooked the first CB. He thinks we're going to give it to Mbappe, but we're going to shoot it far post, and he somehow misses that. 
Very nice step over. Little fake shot, and let's go. That time he puts in the back end of the net, man. Puskas is a very, very quick, I'm not going to lie. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That is indeed one funny-ass goal. Oh, that was nice. Ooh, that was absolutely beautiful. What a boost with that step over, man. Nice. Oh, my goodness. Good try. Damn, good try. Damn, that pace, man. That fucking pace. That's a pen. That's a pen and that should be a red card, bro. His pace with that rapid and quick step combination is fire. We're going to go ahead and shoot the pen with the card itself. All right, I'm going to go top left. Hopefully, we do not choke this. Oh, my goodness. Let's go, man. Let's go. The Travella cooked that CB easily. Good shit, Puskas. All right, boys, and that concludes the review for 93 rated Thunderstruck Icon Puskas. Coming out 2.4 million coins on the market on the PlayStation and Xbox by the time I drop this video. 2.5 million coins on the PC. We played five games with the card, nine goals, zero assists as a striker, and a 4-3-2-1 formation. It's a really good return from the card. Now, I'm going to go ahead and say that Puskas is actually better than i expected i'm not gonna lie i had a little bit of fun running with this card so pros obviously is that he has exceptional pace the 92 acceleration 90 sprint speed going up to 96 and 94 with the engine chemistry style is really nice because he has both rapid and quick step and that helps the card feel nice and quick whether you're running in a straight line performing left stick dribbling or r1 dribbling it, this card has one of the best R1 or RB dribbling depending on what console you're on in the video game that I've used. Out of all the cards I've used, he's up there with the R1 dribbling. Absolutely insanely broken stuff from the card. Step overs are also very clean from Puskas. I think the engine is definitely the way to go. I don't know how he would have felt without the engine chemistry style, but with the engine, he felt super clean on the ball. Attack position was absolutely phenomenal, 97, so it says a lot. He has great work rates, high medium work rates, always at the right spot at the right moment. Great offensive AI making our lives so much easier so we can just find him on the right spot and create the best possible opportunity. Finishing is actually quite interesting because I thought his finishing was solid, but it's, you know, it's not an R9 finishing in my opinion. It's not uh, Mbappe finishing, but it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Obviously, what hurts him the most is that three-star weak foot. That three-star weak foot is absolutely horrific. I'm not going to lie. But at times, he does score with the weak foot here and there. I will say that because of his really high shooting. So that's just something to keep in mind. But whenever you're inside the box with Puskas and you have a nice, easy, either Travella or Finesse shot, it's going to go in nine times out of ten. Just a regular... Power shooting from Puska is a little off inside the box. If you just press B normally, that's sometimes a little iffy. But Finesse and Travella inside the box, pretty consistent from Puskas. Would I go out of my way to buy this card? Obviously not. But if you do pack this Puskas card, because I know a lot of people that pack them, um, go ahead and start your team. Because I think you'll have a lot of fun with the card. Plus Real Madrid already won a game, so he's guaranteed a plus one. And I think they're going to win the next three games. Obviously, uh, coming from a Madrid fan, we are playing exceptionally well at the moment great form so imagine puskas with a play style and another plus one that's gonna be pretty nice hopefully the play style hopefully the play style is like a finesse shot i don't think this card is a top 10 striker for me because like i said he's 4-3 and i think there's way better options but he's obviously he exceeded my expectations just a little bit you know i thought he was gonna be bang average but he's actually pretty solid so he's gonna get thumbs up for me and rating wise for this Puska is gonna get surprising, but solid eight out of ten. Really, really fun card to use, especially because the quickness, the quickness of this card, his offensive AI, and the finishing on the strong foot carries this card a lot. I will say that. But that concludes the review for this card. Thank you guys so much for the support. You guys are absolutely amazing. The next video that I'm gonna be dropping is gonna be a Thunderstruck 
Rafael Varane. We're going to have to see the vibes with that car and if he's potentially a top 10 CV in the game. But till next time, it's been your boy Dan FIFA and I am out. Bye-bye.